Hello, and welcome to my first installment of the Tivoli Enterprise Portal Basics. My name is Jonathan Cham, and I am a Client Technical Specialist for IBM. Now this video is a very basic overview of the Tivoli Enterprise Portal, what it does and what it looks like, and we'll go through a high-level view of the portal interface. Later in my videos, we'll be going through the different panels and windows that you see here in detail. So, the Tivoli Enterprise Portal, for those of you who are unfamiliar with it, it is a single pane of glass and single point of control for managing and monitoring the resources in your IT enterprise. So imagine your dashboard in your vehicle. What does it do? It allows you to monitor the different components in your vehicle, including how much gas you have, the speed you're going, the miles you've driven, the temperature, status of your battery, and a variety of other information about the components in your vehicle. But let's take a step back and imagine that if that dashboard told you information about more than just your vehicle, but everything you own, including your house, your boat, and maybe even where your kids are, right? I'm just kidding about the kids, but you get the point. This dashboard would give you insight on the status of all your assets and everything you own, where they are, what they're doing, and if maintenance is required on them. This dashboard for your personal assets, if it ever existed, is what the Tivoli Enterprise Portal is for your IT environment. It gives you that single point of control and visibility of the resources you own in your IT environment. Let's take a look at the Tivoli Enterprise Portal interface. So you see there's a lot of information here and a lot of data, but we're not going to go into depth about the information, but we are going into how and what these menus and panels do in this interface. So the information that is fed into the Tivoli Enterprise Portal come from agents called the Tivoli Enterprise Monitoring Agents. These agents are installed onto the resources that you wish to monitor, such as your operating systems, your subsystems, platforms, databases, web services. These agents provide all the information that you see in the Tivoli Enterprise Portal. The first screen we're going to look at is the Navigator view. Now this Navigator view provides a hierarchical view of the enterprise, but it can be customized the way you want it to be. The default view is the physical connectivity of your enterprise and is automatically determined by the agents that are installed. From this view, you will be able to access all your resources and the information that is provided by your agents. The workspaces is everything around the navigator view. This is the primary source of information that you will need and that you will see to get visibility into your IT enterprise. It shows you the information of the resources from as high level to as low level as you would like. The menu bar. Now this is a typical Windows menu bar that allows you to control some of the elements and items that you will be learning about later. Take some time to go through the help menu and the 10 minute Tivoli Enterprise portal tour that you see here. The toolbar. Now this toolbar, it gives you a way to manipulate the way data looks, lets you refresh some data, and navigate through the different workspaces. The status bar below just shows some basic information about the servers that provide information to the Tivoli Enterprise Portal. Okay, well, that's my brief introduction, and thank you for taking the time to listen to this overview of the Tivoli Enterprise Portal. You can just see how easy it is to monitor and control a complex and sophisticated IT environment with this software. Now stay tuned for more videos as I look forward to helping you learn more about the Tivoli Enterprise Portal. Thank you.